There are a ton of slice of life anime out there, an almost overwhelming amount, and we're here to rank the best in the genre. There's something incredible about watching small moments from everyday life being portrayed on the screen. In a slice of life story, we often see characters similar to ourselves, facing the ordinary struggles of life and going about their daily business. There isn't a rigid focus on tightly knit plots or lots of action. Instead, this genre invites us to linger on the small moments and take things softly and slowly. They often teach us to appreciate the little things in life and pay attention to what we usually take for granted. If you're looking for some slice of life anime, with hints of romance, comedy or even magic, here are some movies and shows that you can check out. Number 15, Laidback Camp. This particular series falls into the cute girls doing cute things subgenre of slice of life, and it's a G-rated adventure in the great outdoors. These high school girls eschew fast food restaurants and karaoke bars and instead go camping on the weekends, or whenever they find the time. This series is charming and quite relaxing to watch, and it doubles as a mildly educational peek into how camping is done. The characters are simple but adorable, and the scenery is gorgeous. 14. Nichijou. This one shares some elements of cute girls doing cute things, but in this case, it's more like cute girls doing outrageous things. This bizarre comedy series is set in an ordinary high school where just about every character has a wacky secret or hobby. Yuko is the most ordinary girl, and even she is totally silly. Meanwhile, the young professor loves sharks and snacks, there's a robot girl with a crank, and there's also Mio, an excitable girl who tries to hide her hobby of drawing boy love, VL, amateur manga. You never know what you'll get with Nichijo. 13. Azumanga Daio. This animated series, based on the comic strip style manga of the same name, finds charm and beauty in the ordinary life of high schoolers. The main characters are a handful of eccentric girls who get part-time jobs, adopt pets, annoy each other on field trips, and more. There is little drama and few real stakes, but that doesn't stop Azumanga Daio from serving as an accessible, timeless gateway anime series for anyone who's looking to get into Japanese animation. It also has a quirky and hilarious opening credit song. 12. Your Lie in April. This series has some elements of drama in it, along with some serious heartbreak near the end. Without spoiling anything, suffice it to say that the main character, Kosei Arima, is a musical prodigy who can no longer hear his own music. His troubled relationship with his mother has soured his piano skills, but then he meets an upbeat girl named Kaori who puts the music right back in Kosei's life during their last days of middle school. It's a personal journey that has to be seen to be believed. 11. A Silent Voice This animated movie, based on the short manga series of the same name, also packs a punch with its drama, though there is some humor in it too. This time, the themes revolve around forgiveness and redemption. In 6th grade, Shuya Ishido was a cruel bully to his deaf classmate Shoko, but now, in high school, Shoya is determined to make things right with Shoko before it's too late. Will he find love, too? He just might. 10. Only Yesterday, 1991. Taiko Okajima is a young working woman who takes a trip to the countryside to visit her distant family and take a break from the hectic city life of Tokyo. The train ride home brings back memories from her childhood and her school days. The narrative switches between the past and the present as the character contemplates the incidents that left a lasting impact on her and wonders just how much she has changed. In the end, she is left with a quiet epiphany as she decides to settle down in the countryside. Only Yesterday is a beautiful, meditative film that is laced with a sense of wistfulness and bittersweet nostalgia. 9. Dagashi Kashi If you're looking for something food-themed, then you're in for a literal treat. This anime series revolves around a dagashi shop, a shop that sells cheap sweets and candies. Kokonatsu, the son of the shop owner has no intention of running the shop, as he wishes to be a manga artist. One day, a stranger Hotari Shidera arrives with the hope of recruiting Kokonatsu's dad to join Shidera Corporation, an internationally renowned sweets company owned by her family. The dad will only agree if she can convince Kokonatsu to take over his shop. Given that dagashi shops are pretty rare, this heartwarming highlights a part of Japanese culture that you may have otherwise, missed. 8. Kiki's Delivery Service Another Studio Ghibli film, this one follows the adventures of little Kiki who leaves her home in the countryside and travels to the big city on her own, to live an independent life, as is customary for all trainee witches. A slice-of-life coming-of-age fantasy film, Kiki's Delivery Service focuses on the ups and downs of the titular character's life as she makes new friends and starts a courier service delivering goods to people on her broomstick. If you've enjoyed this delightful film, there's an anime series on a similar theme called Flying Witch, 2016, that you'll absolutely adore. 7. Clanid, 
Planet originally started out as a visual novel that was later adapted into manga, audio dramas, anime series, and even a film. The show revolves around Tomoya Okazaki who frequently misses school and lacks any sense of purpose in life. However, it all begins to change when he meets Nagisa and decides to help her and her four friends to revive the school's drama club. Soon enough, Okazaki is filled with renewed purpose and motivation. While the first season received decent reviews, the second season opened to critical acclaim. 6. Whisper of the Heart If you're looking for a feel-good romance film, then this Studio Ghibli movie is a perfect treat, focusing on the love story between bookworm Shizuku and Seiji, a violin maker, who also attends the same school. Filled with heartwarming and funny moments, there's also a story within a story in this film as Shizuku who dreams of being a writer one day, writes a fantasy story featuring herself, a cat statuette called the Baron and a cat she followed on the train. While the love story is nicely resolved at the end of the film, the cat story gets a sequel of sorts in the spin-off The Cat Returns, 2002. 5. Violet Evergarden Violet Evergarden is thought-provoking and poignant, with beautifully rendered art. The series follows Violet Evergarden, a child soldier who has become an auto-memory doll who is tasked with writing letters on behalf of other people. While Violet with her mechanical postures initially has difficulty fitting in, the series focuses on her emotional journey as she begins to understand and express human emotions, relate to other people, even as she ponders over the meaning of the last words Gilbert, a major had told her. And what were those last words that she struggles so hard to decipher? I love you. 4. Arya the Animation If you're looking for something more futuristic but with an old world charm, then Arya might be the anime you're looking for. It is set in the 24th century on the planet Mars, now called Aqua, in a place called Neo Venezia, sounds familiar, right? And no, there isn't any epic space war going on. Instead, we follow the adventures of Akari Mizunashi, a teenager who is training to be a tour guide in the city's gondola service. A slow-paced show filled with gorgeous visuals and a sense of optimism, Arya makes for a memorable watch. 3. 5 cm per second, Makoto Shinkai's films have been expressly praised for the picture-perfect visuals so well composed and artistically rendered that almost every frame can be a wallpaper. Moreover, the director is known for his careful attention to detail, focusing on the small meaningful moments of life that we often barely notice. This film is divided into three episodes, all centered on a boy named Takaki Tono, and it delves into the themes of unrequited and unrealized love and a deep-seated melancholy. Be warned, this one might leave you in tears. 2. Toradora. For romance lovers, Toradora is a brilliant slice-of-life anime with well-written and fully fleshed-out characters. The series focuses on Ryuji and Taiga, who seem to have diametrically opposite personalities. While they both agree to help each other with their crushes, their attempts backfire and they are placed in awkward romantic situations. A funny and heady emotional roller coaster ride, Toradora at just 25 episodes, makes for an engaging watch. 1. Anohana, the flower we saw that day. Jinta Yadomi lives as a recluse, skipping school to playing video games at home. However, one day, the ghost of his childhood friend Menma, who died five years ago in an accident, suddenly appears, asking for help to fulfill a wish. Soon enough, Jinta is reunited with his estranged childhood friends as they try to solve the mystery, and, by doing so, they have to confront feelings that they have long hidden away. Regarded as a masterpiece, this anime tells a poignant story with just 11 episodes. So, there you have it, the 15 best slice of life anime of all time. And, that's been it. Thanks for watching. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.